Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. This video will demonstrate how to wire the EL1SS without a telco line. This video is intended for demonstration purposes only. Please consult the manual for complete instructions and safety information. Do not install more than one EL1SS on a phone line. It is critical that telco service is fully disconnected before wiring the EL1SS for no telco service. The unit can be a standalone system that allows communication between the unit and the resident's phones. When the EL1SS is used as a standalone system, you must use intercom mode. You will need the following items. 18 to 24 gauge twisted pair wire such as Belden's 9501 or equivalent. A small screwdriver. Please note, do not run telecommunication lines through the same conduit with high voltage lines. This diagram shows an overview of how the system components are arranged. The phone connector on the EL1SS processor board connects to the telco terminals in the demarcation point. The home telephone line remains connected to the telco terminals in the demarcation point. Tip and ring connections are indicated on the EL1SS processor board and usually in the demarcation point. For this demonstration, we will use the new color standard for wiring indicated in the manual, with white wire used for tip connections and blue wire used for ring connections. The wire colors at your installation may vary. In the EL1SS, insert the blue wire in ring and the white wire in tip on the phone connector and tighten with a screwdriver. In the demarcation point, do not disconnect the home phone wiring connection that is already in place. Connect the blue wire from the EL1SS to the ring terminal and the white wire to the tip terminal. This connects the EL1SS to the existing house phone wiring. Wiring is complete. Be sure to enable intercom mode when you program the unit. Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. Learn more about our access control solutions when you visit us on the web at liftmaster.com slash access control.